Good morning and welcome to our RSEA webinar conversation today. My name is John Green with Association Member Benefits Advisors and joined by Jimmy Anthony, your Executive Director for RSEA. Just a couple of housekeeping details before I turn it over to Jimmy to talk about what's going on at RSEA today. Um, all participants are in a listen only mode. And what that means is, is that we can't see you or hear you, but if you've got questions, please put those into the Q&A feature. We'll monitor that throughout the conversation. And if there's something that's specific to you, we'll probably respond back to you. But if it's something that the general group could benefit from, we'll stop and answer that question as we go along here. We are recording this session. We will make it available to you after the fact. It'll also be on the RSEA website that you can go out there and pay attention to that. You'll notice that there is a QR code on the bottom right-hand corner here. We're gonna have several people on the call today that probably are not members of RSEA, and that's great. We appreciate you joining us. But if you want more information about membership, about the benefits of being with RSEA, you can use your smartphone to hit up that QR code, and we'll show you that as well. Uh, we're going to send you uh, some information for those of you who are members after the fact. But grab a pen and paper today because we're going to tell you a whole bunch of different things, and we want you to make sure that you're up to date and up to speed on what is going on at RSEA and how it can impact you as a member as well as those of you who are not members, and we definitely want you to get joined in here. But let me go ahead and turn it over here to Jimmy, Jimmy Anthony, your Executive Director for RSCA. And Jimmy, every time I turn around, there is so much going on there. So tell me what's uh, happening out there. Yeah, well, we've got several things going on. Uh, right now, we're taking applications for our scholarship program. In the last two years, we've been able to give away $1,000 uh, educational scholarship to two students of uh, actually were grandchildren of some of our members. And we're taking those applications. The application deadline is April 28th, so we need to get them in pretty quick. Uh, you can see uh, Danielle Sheck Snyder down on the top right that received her check. She's from Port Barry, Louisiana. And then Ethan Desotel, bottom left, he is uh, from Marksville. Those are our last two winners. And uh, this year, because of the generosity of our membership, we're able to fund two $1,500 scholarships. That's 3,000 as opposed to $1,000 a year. So we were very excited about that. So we can make two people a little bit uh, better shaped to pursue their, their educational dream. Uh, <clears throat> I wanna give our membership a little bit of information on the uh, update of WEP and GPO. For those of you who do not know what WEP is, uh, it's the windfall elimination provision and it unfairly penalizes state employees because of the lavish pension that they draw. At least that's what the feds, feds thinks. Uh, the average pension drawn by state employees is about $25,000. So it, it's not lavish, but it do penalize us. And we've got a bill in Congress now is being authored by Garrett Graves, who resides here in Baton Rouge. And he is our champion on this issue. Last year, we got enough co-sponsors on the bill to have a floor hearing and a vote on it. But the Democratic leadership decided to put it in committee before they went to the floor and effectively killed it. So now the Republicans have the House. It'll be interesting to see if they can get that bill moved out of the House. And just to let you know, the Senate has a similar bill. It's sponsored by uh, Sherrod Brown out of Ohio. The Senate bill has 37 co-sponsors, while the House bill has 223 today. So there's a lot of support to do away with WIP and GPO. Our own Senator Bill Cassidy has told me several times that he doesn't think these measures are going to make it through the final process as a standalone legislation. And he is proposing a serious overhaul of Social Security that would include the repeal of weapon GPO. So there is hope for us. And uh, I think uh, if we don't give up, eventually we'll prevail on this issue. Absolutely. Well, Jimmy, Jimmy, so let's talk about a little closer to home. Tell me what's going on with the yeah. big Senate bill. Yeah. The, uh, the legislature tasked us two years ago was coming up with a way to properly fund, restructure the way COLAs are, are funded for state employees. Most of you probably don't remember the last time you got a COLA because it's been seven years. And guess what? You're not going to get one this year either. So 
we spent a lot of time and effort coming up with a, a way to fund this that's more reasonable and will bring about colas on a more uh, structured way. We hope that this will provide enough money that we can get a cola for our state employee retirees every two to three years. But we need to start now. The iron is hot. The chairman of the Senate Finance Committee has written the bill and it has been co-authored by the president of the Senate, Paige Cortez. So we got some heavy hitters going up to bat for us, but they're gonna need some help. We're gonna need some help. This bill will, will begin its journey this coming Monday at one o'clock. We're asking anybody who can come to the legislature, come meet with us, committee room E, outside the committee room E, all you have to be able to do is sign your name to a green card, fill out some information showing that you support this bill. And we're gonna download a toolkit for you on our website that will detail exactly what you need to do. If you do not give us your email, we can't keep you in the loop. So I'm asking all of you to send me your email Please join RSEA. I'll keep you in the loop, and we don't let need to let this opportunity slip by us, because we may never get another cola if we have to depend upon market issues like we do now. All right, Jimmy, I appreciate that. Anything else that you want to share with us that's going on at RSEA? I know you're busy with Senate Bill 18, but uh... well, yeah, that's that's the main things we're doing right now is. Uh, looking at this legislation, trying to uh, regain some of our membership that we lost through COVID. And if y'all know anybody who has a student that could use some money, uh, you have to be a member for three years in order to sponsor one though. So if you're unsure if you've been a member for three years, call us, we'll, we'll look you up real quick. Great, well, thank you very much for sharing with us. If you've got questions, please put those into Q&A and we can, at the end of the conversation, we can have that uh, discussion as well. Jimmy, thank you for joining us today. Uh, real quickly, my name is John Green with Association Member Benefits Advisor. I, li I live a little bit north of Houston, and with my wife, who's in education, I grew up in a, uh, a state employee household. My grandfather, my mother, and my aunt all worked for the state of Texas in the highway department, so I appreciate what you do to keep Louisiana going and for what you did in your career. So I, I appreciate the opportunity to join you today, and I'll be your host today, but just to what Jimmy was talking about, RSEA does so many things on your behalf to watch out for your pension first and foremost. Since you work so hard or work so hard for the state of Louisiana, you wanna make sure that your pension is secure and that there's an opportunity for a cost of living adjustment to somewhat keep up with inflation right now. Fighting to help preserve any type of benefits that you receive from a healthcare perspective after the fact. Uh, also keeping you connected, back out with spring meetings, the fall convention, things like that, and offering benefits and discounts in the scholarship program so much more that RSEA does on your behalf. It's only $19 a year to join RSEA. And the more people that are in RSEA, the greater the chance of passing legislation, key legislation like Senate Bill 18. Those type of volume numbers speak loudly to legislators when they see that there are so many people behind this. So highly encourage you to get involved with that. Again, I'm gonna show you at the end how you can get information about membership, where you can contact us. We'll get emails, collect those type of things and be able to take care of you as well. So please drop that in there. So we do have a question that came in here. Um, this is a question, Jimmy, that you can help answer here. Sharon ask us, are TRSL retirees eligible for joining RSEA? Is she retiring from LSU? Yes, absolutely. We will uh, uh, take anybody who wants to uh, raise awareness for state employees and retirees. We have several teachers that are members with us as well as TRSL. And so, um, yes. And I think Senate Bill 18 impacts all four of the different uh, pension systems in the state. Is that correct? That is correct. And the teachers will be there in force. And uh, we hope that we can have a significant volume of people there, too, to kind of show them that uh, they're not the only ones that are lobbying for this measure. OK, great. Great question, Sharon. Thank you very much for that. Shout out to the LSU Tigers and uh, Kim Mulkey for winning the national championship in basketball. Hey. Pretty impressive. She, uh, I know she's a hometown Louisiana girl, but we had her at Baylor for three national championships and then you got her. So congratulations. I love Kim, but uh, yep. 
congratulations to the Tigers. It was a heck of a ball game. So uh, keep that up. Keep those questions coming in. We got another question that just came in. Uh, okay, that was from Sharon thanking us for that. Just a quick reminder at AMBA, Association Member Benefits Advisors, we work with associations all across the country and are proud to work with the RSCA to make sure that you have the best access to benefits in your retirement years or in your active years. Caitlin Tidwell is our manager uh, in, uh, in Louisiana, lives there in South Louisiana, and we're grateful for her and her team. They can be glad to help you out there. There are some advantages of having RSCA and AMBA together, kind of fill some of those gaps of benefits that aren't covered by your state plans. They're portable. If you leave the state for whatever reason, or if you uh, um, move, they're not tied to any particular network out there. And the one thing that a lot of RSCA members really like is they can extend their benefits from RSCA to family members, maybe to adult children who have, who have aged out of your state benefits and things like that. Or if you've got parents, you can take care of your loved ones that way as well. So today we're gonna to talk about something kind of fun. We're going to talk about the discount program, and this program is free for RSCA members. It is a way to help your pay and your pension check stretch even further. It's travel savings all across the state, across the country and the world. So it's a great way. If you like to eat, shop, travel, you can save a lot of money. So I'm going to show you a couple of things in here today. We're going to introduce you to the My Amba Discounts program, share with you a couple of popular discounts that are out there as well help you dream a little bit. And uh, we're going to, uh, you know, have some have some fun as we go along here and talk about some discounts. I'm going to show you some live tutorials as well. But as we're talking about this MyAMBA discount program, it is from AMBA. It is through the Passport program. It's a free benefit for RCA members. Covers everything that you see out there in terms of dining, shopping, and things of that nature. There are two ways that you can access this program. And for those of you who are members on the call today, I'm going to send you a special sign in here in a moment. Those of you who are not members and you want to become a member, we'll show you how you can become a member and take advantage of this as one of your first ways out there. You can sign in on a laptop or they have a great mobile app. And this mobile app allows you, it's geolocated for lack of a better term. So it knows where you are and allows you to look at your discounts in your area. So whenever I travel over to see Jimmy and I wanna see the restaurants in Baton Rouge, I can look up where I am in Baton Rouge and it'll say within a five mile radius, here are all the restaurants that I can save money on. So it's really kind of a cool way to do it, especially if you travel long distances and you're along a route, you can see what hotels are in your area as well as you go through there. So for those of you who are RSCA members, Jimmy and I are gonna make this very easy for you. I'm gonna send an email to you that's gonna have a link. All you have to do is click that link. It takes you right in without any passcodes or anything. It recognizes you as an RSEA member. You'll just put your email address in there. You'll set up your profile. The profile allows you to filter the discounts that you want the most. Now it doesn't preclude you from getting any of the discounts, but say you've got pets or you like to travel or you've got grandkids. And what it will do is it will kind of say, hey, here are the top discounts for pet owners, things like that. So you do that and you're in. Again, this is free to you. And I'm going to show you a couple of things as well, because if you get down a pay route, it's going to ask you to pay $8 a month. And we don't want you to do that because as an RSEA member, this is already free as part of your membership. So I talked about the mobile application. I'm going to show you how it works. And then I'm going to show you some discounts as we go through here. But say you've come over to, to Texas, you've gone to Dallas and you're hungry, and you open up your mobile app and you see, oh, right there is some restaurants that I want to eat at. There's the Magic Time Machine. So you hit Magic Time Machine, and you'll see that it gives you 60% off of gift certificates. You simply hit the website button on your phone, on your app, and the offer will pop up. And it will tell you, you can get a $25 gift certificate, gift certificate for $6. Minimum purchase of the restaurant is $50. Sometimes it'll say includes all purchases except alcoholic beverages, things like that. It'll kind of give you some restrictions if there are any. You simply purchase that put it in your My Certificates folder there on your app. You can show that then to the waiter, waiter or waitress and get your discount right there. So that's an easy way to do that. Another way is you're going to get a, on your phone, you're going to get a mobile passport card. And I'll show you what that looks like in a moment. But you may see a vendor or merchant that offers a use card feature, which basically says they're going to offer you a 20% discount or a BOGO offer right there on the spot. You just hit use card. 
your electronic ID card will pop up on your phone and you just show that to the uh, person that checks you out there at the restaurant or at the store. Really simple. Sometimes it will tell you this is good for all of the TCBY yogurts in a certain area, or this is only good at this particular location, something like that. So you can use your card when you're traveling. You can use the discounts online. I'll show you those things as we go through the live tutorial in just a moment. So let's talk about shopping and services first, because this is everything from restaurants and retail stores to online vendors all across the country, buying a car, renting an apartment, refinancing a home, tons of things, including travel, theme parks, things like that, all sorts of shopping discounts all across the country and as well as in the state of Louisiana. So a lot of people ask us, they say, hey, what about homewares, things for my house, uh, linens, things of that nature, gifts, or what about spring uh, gardening season? Jimmy just talked about beforehand, he just started his garden up. There are many vendors that are out here. Most of them are online vendors, unless you go to some major metropolitan areas, especially out west. But most of the online vendors, your best choice products is kind of like a, a, a high-end Macy's or a Dillard's without the clothing. And you're going to get all sorts of seasonal goods out there as well as your housewares. Alico is probably the best place that I've seen for home and garden supplies. Then you get Kohl's for online savings, GNC for online or in the stores. Skechers Footwear is always runs a 30% off coupon that's out there available to you. And you can print that coupon, take it into their discount store, or you can shop online using the passcodes out there as well. Um, now, I had a question in here about receiving a card in the mail. So um, are you talking, and this is a question that came from Duana. If you there is not a discount card for that you would receive in the mail for the passport program, I'm going to show you how you can get uh, access to it through your email. So there would not be anything that you'd expect to get in the mail in terms of a discount card. Now, Jimmy, this question could have been directed at do they receive an RSEA membership card in the mail? Is there anything like that that they receive? Yes, when they join for the first time, we send them a card for RSE membership. Okay. All right. So, so that a different situation. We're not talking about using your RSEA card there. The passport program, you would use it on your mobile phone or you'd print a coupon or you can just buy directly from the vendor. I'm going to show you that as we go through there, but that's a good question. I don't want any, anyone to be under the misconception that if they're an RSEA member, that they should be expecting a discount card in the mail in regards to that. Now, Easter just passed, but Mother's Day is right around the corner. You can get discounts off of flowers, off of Harry and David, Popcorn Factory, Sherry's Berries. We talked about LSU earlier. Finals are coming up here next month. If you want to send some cookies to your grandkids, uh, wishing them well during finals, you can do that and save 15%. Or if you're, you're a mother that's on the, the webinar today and you want to make drop a hint to your uh, kids that you would like some wine, there are many subscription programs that are out there for steaks, wine, all sorts of things. Lots of different discounts if you're sending some gifts across the through the mail as well as subscriptions and shopping, uh, food services, things like that as well that are out there. So lots of ways to stretch your dollar. If you're a magazine reader, Magazine Advantage is part of the Passport program out here. It gives you $2 subscriptions for annual subscriptions to about two or three dozen different magazines. Again, just another way to stretch your dollars and uh, catch up on some good reading there as well. It's graduation season. High school and college graduation here in the next six weeks or so. The tech gifts that are out there. If you're looking for Apple products, there is Apple employee pricing, and that includes on iPhones as well as the iWatches, the Apple Watches, and the earbuds, those type of things. Then HP, Lenovo, Dell, Samsung, they're running technology and camera gifts all the time for sometimes up to 70% off. I'll show you on the website in just a moment where you can find those really, really great ways to uh, to save money either for yourself or for a gift for somebody that's going off to college or something of that nature. So I'll show you those really super neat ways to save some money out there. The biggest, newest discount that's out here and one that a lot of our retirees are taking advantage of is the Whirlpool Inside Pass. And they're running a hot deal. It's getting near the hot end of the hot deal right now where you can save 37% off major appliances, then an extra 10% off small appliances. And uh, so it's a great way if you're getting, looking for a KitchenAid mixer. We've had many, many retirees save several hundred dollars 
and they include free shipping on dishwashers, on refrigerators, things like that. So it's just a neat way that you can save additional money on the top of uh, on a great product. Probably the number one um, saving program that I've seen out here on the Passport program, as far as the most popular, is the Sam's Club and Costco memberships. These are for new memberships, and I want to point this out for two reasons. One, it is a new membership, so it's not a renewal membership. But number two, these offers change all the time. Sometimes it will be 60% off plus a small gift card. Sometimes it will be 60% off the membership plus a basket full of food. It varies from time to time, but this is a great way to stretch your money. If you're not a member of one of these uh, membership clubs, you can get involved with that or give this as a gift to someone as well that can take care of that. But that's a very popular discount out there. Well, let's talk about travel because this is probably where most members are going to save money is through travel. If you like to travel across the state, like to go down to New Orleans for a, a weekend vacation or go over to Florida um, to uh, uh, Gulf Shores or Pensacola, uh, those type of things in Alabama and Florida, you can save a lot of money through travel. I'm going to walk you through these discounts because they're wide and they're vast and then show you some of the discounts when we go on the live tutorial. Some of the most popular discounts or the most uh, consistent discounts out there are the Wyndham chain. The Wyndham chain, um, you can save up to 20% on hotels, days in all the way up to the high-end Wyndham vacation clubs. If you're an Airbnb type person, Haven HVN is their equivalent. They've got really neat uh, locations out there. Oftentimes they'll run specials for a certain percentage off and they'll waive some of the fees. So it's a really neat way to do that. Uh, if you're a cruise fan, there are so many cruise lines out there offering discounts right now. You can take advantage of that, plus get upgrades and things of that nature. And if you like to go to cultural attractions, museums, um, different art places, things like that, tickets, T-I-Q-E-T-S, is the best place to find those things. And I'll show you that in the live tutorial in just a moment. But my favorite place to look is the Passport Travel Services Hotel Planner. I, I travel quite a bit for work, love to travel over to Louisiana, then to Florida for personal. and I always go check out here because you're going to see the latest discounts. You're going to be able to see and rate it by star rating, rate it by reviews, rate it by um, proximity to particular attractions, things like that. And I'll show you the live tutorial in just a moment. But you can see, you can save, go over in Gulf Shores or Orange Beach, uh, you know, $200 or more on certain hotels down in New Orleans, you know, $60, $70, $80 on certain hotels as well. I mean, just use this one time, you're gonna save five years worth of your RSCA membership. And it's a very easy tool to use. And I'll show you, talk about a little more when we do the live tutorial in just a moment. The other things that are out there, if you're going to Florida, lots of savings on extended stay America suites. You'll see those all across the country. Rent, rent cars, if you're needing to rent a car, your Hertz, Avis, Enterprise and budget, 25% off all the time. Sometimes they'll run additional savings on top of that. We talked about the cruise savings. If you're looking to fly somewhere and you're one of those that just like to check in the websites every once in a while, there is a program within the passport program called Going, where if you're looking to go to a European destination or somewhere a little bit more expensive, you can get a membership at a greatly reduced price and they will monitor flights. And they'll say, hey, if you're looking to go to Paris, Right now, so-and-so airline is running a discount for this price. You want to lock it in, that type of thing. So it's really a neat travel service that's out there. So many travel opportunities out there that you've got. If you're staying a little closer to home, you want to take the kids or grandkids to the movies, or you like to go to the movies yourself, all the major chains are out here. You can save 20 to 30% off on movie tickets. It's basically like buying a midweek matinee price ticket. You can use it on the weekends, however you want to use that but uh, great movie discounts and save more than your membership in RSEA just by taking one or two uh, uh, trips to the movies out there. Tickets at Work is also one of my favorite uh, places for several reasons. One, if you're traveling to Orlando, if you're traveling to anywhere that has lots of theme parks over here in Texas, going to SeaWorld, any of the Six Flags parks or down into Florida, you can save significantly on theme park tickets as well as tours, things like that. If you're going out to Las Vegas or going to New York, the shows, hotels, you can do that. If you're staying close to home and just going to see the Tigers, baseball program, 
basketball, football, that type of thing, you can get your discount tickets there as well and save money off what you'd pay at the gate. They also have pro tickets, college tickets all over the country as well. So at ticketsatwork.com out there through that. So I'm going to stop here because I'm going to come back to this and show you how you can suggest some merchants if you've got some favorite restaurants you want to eat. But I want to take you real quickly to the website. And I want someone to drop in here into the Q&A feature. Um, all right. I'm going to answer some questions about RACA membership here at the end. Somebody put in the Q&A feature what city they'd like to go to. If they're, uh, if they're traveling, if you're thinking of a summer vacation or something here pretty soon, drop it into Q&A, and I'm going to do some searching. But what you'll find out here when you come to the website and whenever you put in your information in here and sign up, you're going to have multiple ways that you can look at what city you want to go to. You can see what offers are all available out there. You can look at dining, and you can say, I want to look at all restaurants, a certain type of food, um, the, the edible gifts, those type of things, meal prep and catering shopping you can look at home and garden you can look at clothes and accessories autos boats those type of things um, tech and electronics that's where you'll find all the apple programs things like that as well under more you're going to find your tickets out here if you want just tickets you can look at that then as you scroll down whatever city you plug in and this is a city outside of austin you will see you've got 600 plus offers out here how many offers are in the uh, the uh, latest 12 months You've got tiles that you can select if you want to just look at those that way. You'll see your seasonal selections here. Sometimes it'll be a certain destination or it'll be spring savings, things of that nature. Some of the newest offers that are out here across the board. These hot deals. I showed you kind of a hot deal for the uh, um, Whirlpool, but oftentimes restaurants, hotels, vendors will put certain things out here. Here's budget. You can rent a, an SUV for as low as $69 a day. 32 days, it'll put what the time frame is out here, certain credits, things like that. The other feature that I like is you can scroll down and see just visually what merchants are available to you in your area. If you want to look at it that way. So we do have some folks that have put in some, some cities out here. And let's go down and just pick one of these out here. So, all right, Gail, you wanted to know about New York. All right, I appreciate that. Let's go ahead and plug in here into the Big Apple. And we're going to look at what's out here in New York. So it's going to take that. It'll pop up here and it'll show that there are 1,372 offers in New York available to me. Now, a lot of these are online, but some of them are face-to-face. -face. And so here it's going to pop up and populate the, uh, the map and show me all of the shops and restaurants that are available out here. But let's just say that I want to go out and look for hotels. So I'm going to show you what hotels are out here. And this is a way that you can do, no matter what city you go to, this is how you can look for the hotels that are out here. Now, it's pulling up for me in New York, same way it would do if I was in Pensacola. It would pull up and show me what my Top discounts are out here. There's some Wyndham hotels out there that you can look at, Extended Stay America, Great Wolf Lodge. If you ever want to take any of your grandkids to a phenomenal resort, Great Wolf Lodges, sometimes they run 75% off out there. Then you get some of the, uh, the uh, vacation clubs around there. But let's go down here and look at the Passport Hotel Planner. Again, this is my favorite site, the Passport Hotel Planner. You can plug in where you want to go. And let's just say I want to put in Times Square in New York City. All right. And I'm going to pick a date and say we're going to go in May for a couple of days here. And it's going to search. Now, it's going to pull up a search. And it may tell me uh, in this situation, it falls over Memorial Day weekend. So it may not give me the best rates out here but it will tell you what is available to you out there. I may go change some dates just to see if we can find some better savings, but it will also rate for me. I can choose by star rating. I can choose by, like we said, if we've done by location, I can choose by name. I'm a big Marriott fan. I could plug in Marriott and it would just bubble up all the Marriott's that are available to me. So already you see out here, it's pulling up some hotels that are in Times Square. If you've ever stayed in New York City, hotels are not in, not cheap. Um, there's a hundred and, $30, $40 savings out here, and 
$15 savings out here. So there's all different types of savings across the board that you can look at in terms of, of in the city in whatever city you're going to. So you can plug that in there and type that and go check those things out. Again, it works for any city out there. All right, um, let's just see a couple of other things. Say I wanted to get tickets for theater shows. Okay, let's go out and look at my tickets. It'll pop up here. There we go. All right, so it's going to pull up my ticket offers here. And so it'll show if you're in the city, if there's something specific as far as a museum, like I mentioned tickets here, Empire State Building. I will tell you on tickets, T-I-Q-E-T-S, not only can you save money on the actual ticket to get into the attraction, oftentimes they will sell you a ticket with a front of the line pass or the chance to reserve your time. And so it's really a neat way to save time in addition to money out there as well. So lots of things out here for New York attractions, but I want to try to find if I can find the, uh, there's where you get your movie tickets out there. If I can find tickets at work, let's look at the tickets at work site. Tickets at work, like I mentioned, that's where you can find your tourist attractions. You can find your theme parks, but you can also find your professional and college sports out there as well. It's probably the best one that you can go out and find those. So again, highly encourage you to check that out. If I'm going to pull up, I can pull up the city and I'll look at New York here. You can see cities all across the country. You can plug in the city that you want to. And it shows that you've got your tickets for your um, Broadway shows, tickets for all sorts of different attractions, sometimes concerts, things of that nature. So just tickets at work is probably the best place to find this. Um, your concerts that are available to you as well, as well as some of the tours and things like that, especially the Intrepid or some of the uh, circle lines around the island of Manhattan and, and the uh, um, Statue of Liberty. So those are some ways that you can find out there. Again, you can play around on this site. I highly encourage you to do so because it is something that, um, that, that you can't break and you're not going to make the purchase just right off the bat. It, it, it takes you through several steps. Now, I'm going to show you something real quickly. Because a lot of times you want to say, hey, I want some restaurants close to home. I want a way to, that I can save money close to home, but also support my local uh, merchants. Out here under the account program, you can hit suggest. And when you hit suggest, it will show you how you can suggest a vendor or a merchant or restaurant, a shop, something like that. Now, we're not talking your chain restaurants that don't really have control over how they offer discounts. We're talking about maybe your local eateries and there's some phenomenal food in Louisiana. If you wanna do that, you can put a suggestion in here. We've had many members across the country in different associations suggest local members, local merchants and save money that way as well. So that's a great way that you can save and uh, hope you can benefit from that, but play around with that. Again, I'm gonna send you all of this information Whenever we wrap up this webinar today, Jimmy and I will get back with you and uh, and get those to the members. If you're not a member, uh, I'm going to show you just a moment how you can become a member and uh, learn more about RSEA. So just over the past year, members have saved over $100,000 just at some of our most preferred vendors out here giving the biggest discounts. So I highly encourage you to take advantage of those things. Make your membership in RSEA pay you back, not to mention most importantly, protecting your pension and hopefully getting you a COLA, but saving money as well on top of that. A couple of other discounts that are out there available for you are for Start Hearing and Connect America, just ways that you can save money on hearing aids as well as membership for your um, personal emergency medical devices as well. Please, please, please tell your coworkers and friends about this series. This is an opportunity for you to tell them about RSEA, whether you're retired or not, Tell them about the good work that RSEA does on your behalf out there. And the best way that you can become a member in RSEA is to take your smartphone. Take your smartphone, open up your camera feature, and hover over that QR code. A little form is going to come up, and it's going to say, I want a benefit review. You're going to see an other line down at the bottom of that. And you can just put membership in RSEA. 
that will come back to me. I'll get it with one of Caitlin's team members. They can get you signed up for membership today and they will contact you and get you signed up. It's only $19 a year. And not only does it give you these discounts, but more importantly, it takes Jimmy and his staff to be able to go out and talk about Senate Bill 18. Support those issues that keep your benefits and your compensation and your retiree medical and your, 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 your pension system strong is through your membership in RSEA. So if you're on your smartphone or you're on a tablet and you can't shoot us a QR code and use your camera, you can simply email me at john.green at amba.info. And if you want to have any questions in there, those of you who've put questions in the Q&A, what we are doing is we're recording those questions. We can respond back to you individually with a couple of things. But after this webinar, Jimmy and I will send out a list of, uh, or send out the link to the Passport Program for everyone who's a member. If you're not a member and want to become a member, again, email me, use that QR code. We'll get you signed up for membership today. Jimmy, anything you want to wrap up before you uh, you head off and before you head to the Capitol on Monday? Well, I would like to uh, tell everybody that we have recorded this and uh, we will be posting it on our website. So if you want to go back and look at it and, and to kind of take your time, I know John went through this kind of fast for you, but uh, if you know someone else who couldn't make it to today and might be interested in finding out how they can save their membership dues, I mean, there's hundreds of dollars of savings here. Uh, you can go back and, and tell them that uh, in a day or two, we'll have that uh, have this webinar uh, posted so they can look at it on their own time. Exactly. Jimmy, we had a question. If somebody doesn't know if they're an RSEA member or not, what's the phone number they can call the office there to verify their membership? Yeah, call 225-930-0961, and we'll be glad to tell you about your membership. All right. So grab a pen. Jimmy's going to share that number with you again. And uh, you can call to verify your membership at 225-930-0961. Great. Thank you, Jimmy. Appreciate what you do for uh, state of employees of Louisiana, both retirees and active employees. Because if you're an active employee and joining us now, at some point, you're going to want to have that pension strong and available for you when you retire. And Jimmy and his staff are keeping on top of that, as well as all the RSEA membership. Again, thank you very much for joining us today. We'll have this recording up on the RSEA website in a few days. I'm going to leave this screen up. If you've got any questions, you can use that QR code or email me, and we'll be glad to take care of you. So have a great rest of your week. Jimmy, appreciate you as always, and we'll talk very soon. Take care, everyone. Thanks, John. Thanks, Jimmy.